Hello Cowboys fans! Before we get to the news, I ask everyone to subscribe and leave a like on our video. It's very important for us to reach more people. The Cowboys conducted tryouts with seven different players, Nikhil Harry, wide receiver, Jacob Eason, quarterback, Bryce Perkins, quarterback, Lynn Bowden, wide receiver, Tyron Johnson, wide receiver, Jordan Miller, quarterback, and Zacharias Keyes, quarterback. Tyron Johnson, an experienced wide receiver, has already signed with the team, although it happened at the same time Antonio Callaway was released after his arrest. Therefore, there are still two open spots on the Cowboys roster, as they currently have officially 88 players. Although Johnson was integrated into the team on Monday, it's likely that two more players will be signed from this extensive group. Nikhil Harry, the wide receiver, is a strong candidate for one of those spots. The Cowboys have shown interest in him before. Selected in the first round by the Patriots in 2019, Harry didn't meet the team's expectations, mainly due to an injury that kept him out in the early part of his rookie season. Additionally, this period coincided with Tom Brady's absence in Foxborough, which made it challenging for several players, including Harry, to perform well. Last year, Harry was on the Bears roster but also faced injury issues. When he was finally ready to debut in the season, the Bears' offense was more focused on the running game, which limited Harry's opportunities to showcase his potential. However, it's worth noting that he stood out as one of the top blocking receivers in the NFL, a skill that could be valuable for the Cowboys, especially since they lost Noah Brown, an efficient run blocker. Currently, Harry is an affordable player with untapped talent. He could be a valuable addition to the preseason training, at the very least. However, if he can establish a good connection with Dak Prescott, Harry has the potential to become an important asset as the fourth receiver in Dallas. In 2022, Harry achieved a pro football focus grade of 65.1. Throughout the season, he was targeted nine times, resulting in seven receptions for 116 receiving yards and one touchdown. He maintained an average of 16.6 yards per reception. According to Sportrack, his latest contract was with the Chicago Bears for one year and a base salary of $1.8 million. Considering all these factors, the addition of Nikhil Harry to the Cowboys team could be a strategic decision. As we await the decisions that will shape the future of the Cowboys, Harry's name is one to watch. Until the next video!